My name is Divya Estrani, and I am a current graduate student at Boston University. Um, and for the past couple years, 2015 and 2016, I've gotten to serve as a mentor and instructor for the Boston University iGEM teams. My first introduction to synthetic biology happened as an undergraduate student. Um, I happened to get accepted into a synthetic biology lab, and the research that I was doing really piqued my interest. Um, and that propelled me to pursue subsequent research opportunities and ultimately led me to becoming a student as part of an iGEM team as an undergraduate. So iGEMs played a huge role in shaping the field of synthetic biology. And as an undergraduate student, I heard about the competition and wanted to learn more. So I applied to the um, iGEM program at an undergraduate university and was selected as a team member. My role on the 2015 and 2016 iGEM teams was to be an instructor for the students. And so I supervised all of our iGEM team members and I helped them through their experiments um, both training them in new techniques and also helping them troubleshoot modes of failure that they might have experienced. Um, and not only did I help offer guidance in the lab, in the traditional lab sense, but I also offered a lot of guidance beyond the bench in helping students understand how to take the work that they were doing in the laboratory and move it um, into how it's impacting society today. So as a student on an iGEM team, I have to say that it was a really transformative experience. Um, it was my first real student-driven, um, independent research that I got to do with my uh, iGEM team. Um, and it really shaped how I approached research, not just through addressing certain um, lab problems, but also understanding how the work that I was doing impacted society at large. My advice to young people looking to do science today would be to just get involved and to go for it. Um, using science and engineering, you can actually make a really significant impact on um, many different research uh, areas that directly impact society, whether that's environmental um, advances or um, finding new cures for diseases, um, or even just identifying something new that um, you can contribute to the scientific community.